Hello everyone, this is Nick Milanchek here, and I wanted to do some videos to show my process of how I go about making my comic books. I've had a lot of people ask me my approach on how I go about making my comic book pages, how I go about my art. So I thought I'd do a little uh, video series to show each step that I take in completing uh, one comic book page. So the first video here is uh, the process of creating the roughs for the page. So this is working directly from a script. This is uh, the pencil stages, the sketching stages, you want to call it. But this is setting the groundwork for everything that's going to come after uh, when completing the art. So what we're looking at here is a video from a recent page that I finished. I just wrapped it up. It's from my upcoming series, White Cell Re-Evolution. Uh, this page, there is, it's, it's a big splash page with a couple panels in it. But I wanted to show you how I rough it out and uh, my approach to kind of sketching the scene uh, before I really get into the inks and all that. Uh, the scene, this is described as a bunch of people being electrocuted, basically. Um, so I'm sketching in individual characters um, in the scene. The focus here is to go in real loose and make sure that you set the groundwork for what's to come. Because the better your roughs are, usually the better the page will uh, end up being. It gives you a blueprint, gives you kind of a guide when it comes to uh, getting those final lines that are going to be in there. So in this particular shot, I'm trying to put all the attention on the main figure here. He's uh, one of the scientists in the, in the story, one of the bad guys, and he's getting electrocuted severely here. So that was the, the main goal. Behind him, I want to show there's a multiple uh, other people, some soldiers, a couple scientists that are getting electrocuted as well. Uh, so I'm looking for dynamic poses, like very sh bizarre contortions and things to try to uh, show when the final effects are finished, you'll see that they're all being electrocuted. And again, a lot of that's going to get figured out as, throughout the process. Uh, I, this is a fun stage because this is really where you got to let the storytelling uh, take place. You need to really explore what the scene is supposed to be and what your intention is. I feel going about the roughs and just making them kind of messy and loose and, you know, is beneficial because you're going to get a more expressive artwork, I feel. Um, if you're being very precise in your rough stage, you're giving yourself less options when it comes to the final line work. Because, again, this is all about setting up your line work. This is just to frame. This is just to help establish Everything that the page is going to be is in this stage. It's the most important part of making a comic book art page. Now working digitally like I do, it offers some benefits that you can't get with traditional. Being able to quickly edit, being able to make adjustments on the fly is super helpful um, in the process. It helps with your speed and how quickly you can get the pages done transitioning between the rough stage to the line stage to the ink stage all on layers using digital um, is just very helpful because you can move on to each step um, seamlessly and you waste no time and uh, I, I just really enjoy using the digital uh, media for this um, so now I'll be wrapping up the roughs for this page here and that'll be it for this step and it'll be ready for the line stage. So thanks guys for watching and stay tuned for the next part of the video series where I will do the clean line work and I'll take all this rough and uh, we'll start making a page, finishing it up.